Hey Natalia, I just got done reading your post. Um, I think you have some really good information on all three of the um, different types of urbanism, uh, you, the NU, LNU, and ethnourbanism. Uh, I do agree with, with what you said, saying that at the end of the day, there's always going to be some kind of minority that's that's unhappy. And I just feel like that's a result of, you know, this country has a lot of people coming from all types of places, all different types of places. And um, unfortunately, you know, Latinos are perhaps the second, if not, you know, the biggest, um, how, how can I say, race or culture here in America. So obviously, uh, in a way, Latinos are gonna look after each other, which, you know, unfortunately, it creates other minorities with um, similar issues to which we can relate to, yet um, we focus more on our own. Um, same time, I feel like attempting to, to take care of every single minority is very difficult because, um, Latinos face a lot of issues already, you know, themselves, but, um, you know, it's, it's, it's interesting to see what could possibly be done to make everyone happy. I personally don't think we'll ever be able to make everyone happy. I think combining many cultures is very difficult, especially one of the, one of the best examples I have is us Latinos, you know, we like to we like to have fun, we like to party, and a lot of other cultures aren't aren't on the same page in regards to that. They like to have their weekends quiet, you know, not have to call the cops to come um, quiet other people down. And as Latinos, if someone comes and tells us to be quiet, we just want to be louder. So. Um, it's very difficult to keep everyone happy, but um, I do agree with you uh, in regards to um, the information that you that you put together. Um, hopefully, one day we can all agree on one thing and you know come to an agreement so that everyone can live happy.